Right. So I'm going to show you some exercises you can do it at home if you're over 16, 65. And first one, hold your arms, 90 degree bend, make a fist, and just march. Try to march opposite arm, opposite leg. Try to lift your knees as high as you can. And move your arms. Try this up to one minute. If you're tired, you can always stop. From your side, swing in the arms, lift your knees as high as you can. Next exercise, shoulder rolls. Swing arms big, rotate big. About 10 times back and then 10 times forward. Big rotations. And have a chair ready next to yourself. Hold the chair, cross your arm, lift your leg to the side. Only as high as you can, about 10 times. And bring the chair in front of you. And lift your leg backwards 10 times. Keep your torso, torso straight, your toes facing forward. Try to squeeze your glutes as you lift. And do the other side 10 times. Straight body, cross arm. Lift your leg directly to the side. And bring the chair in front of you. And move your leg to the back. Squeeze your buttock muscles. Keep your torso straight, your abdominal muscles engaged. Two more. Bring the chair next to you again. Single leg balance. Lift your one leg up, cross arm, and hold. For up to one minute. You can always start maybe 10 seconds. Yield up to 20 seconds, 30 seconds, and up to one minute for a goal. And do the other side. Again, cross arms so you're not helping with your arm. Tighten up your abs and glutes and fold. Next, we're gonna be doing a little balance exercise. And a little bit of coordination as well. We're going to stand tall with your shoulders down, feet together, and we're going to be walking the heel to toe, heel to toe. I'm going to show you this one a little bit closer as I move the camera down a little bit. You might see more. So heel to toe, heel to toe. From the side, heel to toe, heel to toe. You go as far as you can, finding the balance, maybe arms out. So hard, it's fine to open the legs a bit wider, more distance between the feet. Imagine there is a line by your side. The top, narrow stance. From the front, again, narrow stance. As narrow as you can. 
Next one. Show. I'm going to move the camera up a little bit. Let's see that again. Take the chair. Open your legs a bit wider. Stretch back. Walk back a little bit. Stretch the back. Make your back as parallel as you can to the floor. Bend your knees and extend the knees. Little more in the knees down and up. Stretch arm to the left. Stretch arm to the right. Stand up slowly. Okay, have a chair ready. Get on the chair. Straight. Take your arms behind the head. Stretch your front of the body. Bring your elbows back. Look up. Slightly extend from your back. And then back center. Inhale, and as you exhale, stretch back. Come back center. Take a nice deep breath. Slowly rotate to the side. Pull the back of the chair or stretch arm. And back to center. And rotate for the direction. And back to center. Side. It's called cat and cow stretch seated. Take a nice deep breath and exhale, round your back. Make a little hollow in the front of the body. Please get abdominal in. Inhale, expand back into the cup. Make a little arch on the back. Try again, exhale, round your back. Inhale, extend. One more time, exhale, out the back. And inhale, extend. Hands in front, one more time. Inhale, and exhale. Last stretch, you're going to do a neck stretch. You're going to grab the side of the neck. Drop your ear to the shoulder, hold the bottom of the chair, or let your arm stretch down toward the floor. You feel the stretch on the right side of the neck. And slowly change your side. Again, let go the arm. Stretch the side of the neck. Take a nice deep breath. And exhale. And back to center. Semi circle to the right. Semi circle to the left. Come on tight. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale. And these are exercises we can do every day. It will take you about 10 to 15 minutes. You can also skip them. You can do three exercises, a little bit in the morning, three exercises in the afternoon.